Hi, I'm Zoe from We Love Stories, and today I'm here with Peter. And Peter's going to tell us about a magical moment with his grandmother, his bubble, from when he was a little kid. I remember my grandmother and my mother, my grandmother lived with us and it was really awesome because she was so funny and just really, really nice to be with. She would always, every, almost every weekend, make spinach pie and she had this huge, big, flat board and this really thin stick that she rolled her pastry out and we'd always sit there right in the corner of the table and we'd say, Babo, daimi tron de samene, which means Grandma, give me a little bit. So she gave us this little ball of dough and we would roll it and she would cook it for us. And it's really strange because now I have, at my workplace, I'm a teacher, I have this wood fire oven and I cook, I make dough and I cook pizzas for students and it comes from my grandmother and my mother. It was a beautiful memory. I can smell the dough, the freshness of the dough and I learnt a lot from her. I suppose what I learnt most, more than anything, was how to include your children in, in your own life as an adult. It was beautiful. Um, and I make the same spinach pie that she made um, way, back then, way back then. You could smell the feta cheese in it, you could smell the pastry and the oil. It was just beautiful and it was all crispy. Like, and she used to roll them all into these little rolls and then she used to make a spiral out of them. And then she used to put it in a pan and put it in the oven. Sometimes she put sesame seeds on them too. <laughs> um, but childhood is such an important part of your life and you carry it with you throughout all your life. Um, and it was a beautiful memory. Uh, I absolutely loved my grandmother. Thanks so much for sharing. Thank you.